evening, Lancer fans, and welcome to Lawrence High School in Lawrence, Massachusetts for this matchup in Varsity Boys Basketball between the Boston College High School Eagles and your Lawrence High School Lancers. It's Sunday, January the 29th, 2023. Here we go, a little weekend action here in the Fieldhouse at LHS, and what a game we have for you. As you know, the Lancers who win the tip off here as Canary gives it back to the point guard. Danny Reyes has the ball. The Lancers are number one in the state of Massachusetts according to the MIAA Power Rankings. 14 and one coming into the game here today. Their only loss of the season against Worcester North that was out on the road. So the Lancers will face off against BC High Record at five and nine coming into the game today. They are number 22 in the MIAA state power rankings. So it should be a great matchup here between two pretty good teams, two of the best teams in the state, dare I say. And the Lancers have the first possession of the game. Out at the baseline into the hands of Marius Canary. The star senior gets into the paint, gets to the basket, draws the foul. He's going to get to the line here for the Lancers. Two free throws coming up for the home team. Here is the crowd settling in. Sunday once again, January the 29th. The Lancers trying to get to 15 wins on the year. Here's Marius from the charity stripe. Hits the first, and the Lancers are on the board. It's 1-0. Lawrence High with a couple of big wins since our last broadcast, including a victory at Central Catholic. Number one and two teams in the state right there, Lawrence High and Central. And the Lancers won on that Friday night at Central, January 23rd. That was a big road win for the Lancers. 55-49, I'm sorry, 54 to 49. The Lancer press working out here as it has been all season. Canary makes the second free throw. The Lancers trying to force a turnover on BC High's first possession of the game. They do force that turnover with 7.26 remaining here in the first. Lawrence High is going to have another possession. Right here in front of our broadcast table, Ryan Grunon gets set to inbound. 6-3 senior. As the referees get everything squared away with the scorer's table. Right across the way, here's Grunon. And he sends it back into the hands of the point guard, Danny Reyes. Castillo to the near side for Canary. He fakes the shot, takes the baseline. Jay gets fouled. And once again, Marius Canary will get to the free throw line. Second possession for Lawrence. Second foul drawn by Canary. He made the first two of the game. Foul was on Quinn Costello, the 6'6 sophomore, number three. You see him there in the lane, his second personal foul. He also picked up the first foul. Marius, three of three from the line to start things off here in the first quarter. And make it four for four. Lancers lead for zip. Here's the inbound pass and BC High manages to get it up the court across the timeline. Stolen by Toby. Good defense by Lawrence High. Here they come on the break. Into the corner. To the basket. What an excellent drive. Danny Reyes with the bucket on the baseline drive. Just like that, it's six to nothing. The number one team in the state off to a fast start here against the BC High Eagles. The Eagles want to talk things over. They call timeout here in the first quarter. We'll take this opportunity to thank you for watching LPS Media. Remember, we are your home for Lawrence Lancers Athletics. 
We broadcast on Comcast Channel 99 and Verizon Channel 41. Don't forget to check us out as well on YouTube. LPS Media broadcasts 24 hours a day covering events at all of the wonderful Lawrence Public Schools. Some of our regular programming includes LHS Sports, theatrical productions, and school news from all around the district. Check out the Lawrence Public Schools YouTube channel to watch LPS Media all day, every day on any device. Get the app or open up your favorite browser and you can watch over 1,000 videos from the last decade. Back to the action, wide open on the long pass for BC High. Foul committed by Lawrence. A layup attempt, no good, but the Eagles get to the line for the first time here today. And at the line, the previously mentioned Quinn Costello, again, 6'6", the sophomore. We've seen him match up defensively so far today against Marius Canary. It's not an easy job for the sophomore who makes the free throw. Eagles on the board now, 6-1 to one the score. And Costello makes them both, 6-2. Here in the first, Lance is on top by four. Reyes up ahead to Canary. Here's the pass inside. Now at the top of the key, the Lancers cycling the ball around with their guard action. Nice fake and the jumper by Castillo is no good. Canary can't grab the rebound. Tie up underneath or is it a foul? Waiting for the signal. It's a jump ball underneath. The possession arrow will Grant possession to the Eagles here, but it's a good job on the offensive glass by Lawrence to at least get the tie up. And now the press once again, working to perfection here. Eagles trying to get it over the timeline, fighting their way across. They do get it across and that's a nice drive to the bucket. Excellent drive by Ivan Thombi. And then Marius Canary gets two right back on the other end. Whistle blown here, the Lancer crowd cheering. And BC High wants to call timeout again as the Lawrence Press doing its job here in the first quarter. Four point game as BC High calls its second timeout with the score, Lancers eight and the Eagles four. Taking a look at the Lancer schedule. Lawrence High coming off a big win at Bill Ricca on Friday night. That was an 83 to 55 victory over Bill Ricca. Before that, as we mentioned, it was the huge road win at Central Catholic. A massive game. Standing room only at Central Catholic. What an experience it was to be in that gym and see the top two teams in the state get after it. Lawrence High down the stretch, hanging on for dear life, and they got the road win against the Raiders. Before that, a tight win against Andover, 65-51. And three straight wins after the loss at Worcester North. Lancers get it into Toby underneath, puts it up off the glass, trying to get his own rebound, falls to the court. BC High in transition. Basket is no good, but a whistle here with 5.51 remaining in the first quarter. Gunan is gonna pick up the foul here on the drive by BC High. Slashing to the basket, that was Matt Dreheim, number 25 in the maroon uniform. A senior guard here at the line. Left-handed shot, good. Answers, quickly get the ball up the court. Here's Canary, Lawrence High loses it out of bounds. Eagles basketball. Down by two now. Lawrence High led six to nothing. Here we are at eight to six. Eagles with a nice long pass to beat the Lancer Press. 
Eagles doing a good job distributing the ball here now in the mid part of the first quarter. The three ball is in and out. Nice rebound there by Ryan Grunon of Lawrence High. Reyes behind the back, thought about the pull up jumper, looking for Toby underneath, but the pass was off the mark. Again, the Lancers press. You can expect a lot of that tonight. Moose has these kids running in practice. They're well-conditioned athletes. They can press you for four quarters in a row. That's what sets this Lancer team apart from the rest of the MVC, the rest of the state for that matter. The three ball from the corner, no good from Costello. Offensive board for BC High and a whistle on the putback attempt. Coach Moose Moore over on the far sideline complaining to the ref. It's in vain though, the foul was before the shot. So BC High will inbound from the baseline with 5.03 to play here in the first. The score eight to six, still the Lancers lead. Here's the pass, Costello with the J. That basket will not count. It's an offensive foul on the Eagles. Eli Kaloran was called for the foul, the sophomore, no, beg your pardon, that was Dreheim called for the foul. His first personal, so. Eagles turn it over via the offensive foul. Here's a three in the air, it comes up short though from Reyes, Lancers get the offensive board. Here's the three from the near side, no good from Ocasio. Eagles come down with it. That's Jonathan Ocasio, by the way. Costello trying to get it inside. Costello trying to set the pick now. His teammate Ivan Yambi with the pass inside and what a rejection! Amazing block by Toby. Ocasio to the basket off the front rim, no good, but man, if you're watching that one on YouTube, you just gotta skip back 15 seconds or so and see that absolute denial by Isaiah Toby in the paint. Ivan Yambi driving to the bucket and Toby said no. 4.15 to go here in the first. The first free throw from Jonathan Acasio is good. Nine six the score now, as you can see on your screen. Lawrence High on top by three, Ocasio. His second free throw is off the mark. Rebound goes to BC High. It's gonna be a foul on Lawrence. I believe Luciano is gonna pick up that foul. Indeed, it is Obi. The six one guard picks up his first foul of the game. DC High slashing to the basket and drawing the call is Ivan Yambi, number 10. He's a captain, junior captain for the Eagles. 6 1 guard does a lot of scoring for this Eagles squad. Who once again are ranked at number 22 in the state of Massachusetts. Of course, that is according to the MIAA power rankings, which will determine the playoff bracket once the regular season is over. Yambi, money from the line. Close game here in the first quarter. Lancers by one. Little three quarter press here from BC High. Now they settle back into their D. Lawrence High turns it over. That's good defense by the Eagles. Here comes BC on the break. The fast break transition layup is good from Yambi. And for the first time today, it's the Eagles out in front. They've got a one point lead over the Lancers here. It's 10-9 as Canary and the Lancer offense tries to get back on track. Here's Marius, gets the pick. Swung into the corner, Ocasio can't hit the three. Rebound is loose, it's grabbed by BC. Now Lawrence High gets it back and that's a smooth little layup there from Joe and Nee Rosario. Lawrence High regains the lead, 11-10. And all the way to the basket wide open was Costello. Good pass and good job by Costello to get wide open. 
BC High regains the lead. Acasio from three right in front of the Eagle bench. First three of the game. Fourteen twelve. Fast pace now to this game with both teams bringing some press. Costello, three ball rims off. Here's the little mid range from Savello. And now Canary trying to answer back with a three, no good. Lawrence High gets the offensive board. Luciano gets the bucket. And Lawrence High regains the lead, 16-14 now. Another long pass up ahead, all the way into the corner for Costello. Put back attempts, third attempt is no good. Ball still loose, and on the fourth attempt, Dancevello gets it to go. All tied up, two minutes to play in the quarter here, 16 to 16. Long three from Marius, comes up a little bit short. Yombi with the pass deep into the corner. It was off the mark. The Eagles seem to have their press beating strategy figured out here, and it's long passes. The Eagles are scoring in transition off some long path passes, getting Dreheim, Savello, and Quinn Costello open. But the Lancers, a very athletic team, will be able to get into those passing lanes if those Eagles passes are a little too risky. So we'll see how that develops throughout the rest of this game. Anyways, first quarter gonna be over soon. Long three is no good from Reyes. Eagles have it. 110 to play in the quarter. All tied up, that little baseline layup is no good. Ball on the ground, who's gonna come away with it here? Toby has it. Mass confusion here as the Lancers get it all the way in. That's no good. Offensive board from Toby, no good. Toby again fighting and he draws the foul. What an effort on that possession by Isaiah Ogambare. Number 21 in white. The Lancers call him Toby. And man, what an effort on the glass there. A couple of well-earned free throws coming up for Toby. Late stages of this first quarter. The Lancers and the Eagles all tied up at 16. First free throw, line drive is good. Lancers back on top by one. Toby trying to stretch out that lead to two. Let's see what he can do. Eighteen sixteen, the score. Toby, money from the line, and let's see if the Eagles can answer back with time running out. Less than a minute to go here in the first quarter. Here's Yambi, guarded by Castillo. Castillo sticking with Yambi, one of the better guards in the state here. Passes it off. Open three from the corner is no good. On the glass, the Lancers have it with thirty-two seconds to play. Reyes. Picks up the dribble, looking for Toby underneath, but a foul on the floor, no shot on the play here with less than half a minute to go in the first. Defensive foul on the Eagles, and the Lawrence Lancers just throw it away, and that's gonna be an easy layup for Yombi. 20 seconds to go here in the quarter. All tied up once again, 18 apiece. Lancers can hold for the last possession here if they want. Here's Reyes slicing through the paint. And that's gonna be a traveling violation on Lawrence. Francisco Santana of Lawrence High, a 6'6 guard. Hook an extra step with it. Nice steal there by Lawrence into the middle. Canary gets the layup at the buzzer. What a way to end the first quarter. A little buzzer beater action on the layup by Marius. 20 to 18 the score after an exciting 
fast pace first quarter here from Lawrence. The Lancers with a two point lead over the BC High Eagles. Folks, thanks for joining us here on LPS Media. We'll take this opportunity to remind you to check out the Lawrence Public Schools Flickr account. Yes, we have photos from sporting events, graduations, theater events, concerts, and so much more. The LPS Flickr account, it's got over 10,000 photos and over 2.1 million views. That's right, over 2 million. So if you haven't checked them out, now is the time. Grab your phone, get the Flickr app, or go straight to flickr.com slash people slash Lawrence Public Schools. Once again, that's F-L-I-C-K-R dot com slash people slash Lawrence Public Schools. Well, that was a fascinating first quarter from an X's and O's perspective. It's the Lancer Press that many teams in the conference and many teams in the state have a lot of trouble with. BC High has somewhat figured it out. Their strategy has been long passing, getting some of their guards and wing players open in the corners. Uh, long passes, as any basketball coach will tell you, does entail a certain amount of risk. So if the Lancers can get in those passing lanes, and balance out their press with a little conservative approach as Toby gets to the basket, draws the foul, and he's getting to the line. What an offensive play by Isaiah Toby. He's at the stripe with a chance for three. Meanwhile, the Lancer offense gassed up right now. We got a three from Jonathan Ocasio. Canary, con consistent scoring all season. Toby, a force on the boards. Misses the free throw, though, and so we continue on here in the second quarter. 22-18 the score. Lancers by four. BC High with possession. Here's the three. The ball rims out. Offensive board for the Eagles, but Lawrence High steals it. Now the Lancers in transition over to the near side corner. Lancers swing it around, get it into Toby. Toby puts it down, puts it up, gets it flicked away. Grunon saves it. Lancer basketball, Reyes for three. Knocks it down! What a shot by Danny Reyes from the near side. Hits the triple and the Lancers have a little bit of breathing room. They get a turnover. Reyes again, he's got five points in the last three seconds. Great defense, leading to offense for Danny Reyes. It's a seven point game after that 5-0 quick run. BC High wants to call timeout and talk things over. That'll give us a chance to remind you to check out the Lawrence Public Schools YouTube channel. Oh yes, get the app or open up your browser, watch our videos. We have over a thousand from the last 10 years. If you're a sports fan, if you're a basketball fan watching this broadcast, then you definitely want to go back and watch the LHS boys basketball team win over Haverhill earlier this season. Haverhill hung in there for about two and a half quarters, hung in there with the top team in the state, but the Lancers pulled away and blew out the Hillies. Also, girls basketball team with a couple of recent games from late December, early January, including the victory over GLTS. And if you're a drama fan, the recent performance of Tom Sawyer, that's up on the YouTube channel. You can check out all those videos as well as previous sports games from previous seasons, other concerts, theatrical performances, and so much more on the Lawrence Public Schools YouTube channel. Here's Yambi for BC High, bringing the ball up. Avoids the trap, now into the corner, Costello. Lost it, but was it tipped out? It's going to remain Eagles ball. Lancers tipped it out of bounds. Yambi trying to inbound here. Tipped away. Toby trying to chase it down. Can't save it. Out of bounds, and it'll still be Eagles basketball here.
Yambi has it, Reyes is guarding him. Tough assignment for Reyes, but he's hanging in there here. Yambi avoids the trap. Eagles trying to penetrate, off balance shot is good by Dreheim. What a shot that was, hanging in the air and knocking down the J. Canary just gets two right back. Marius making it look easy on the drive in transition. Off the glass and in. Lawrence High in control here in the second quarter, but to the basket. BC High, the left-handed layup is good. And the Eagles still within striking distance. Here's an open three from the corner, off the mark. Eagles ball. Yambi to the right hand, almost taken away. Handed off to Dreheim. Another off balance shot and he makes another one. Dreheim on consecutive possessions, tough shots. Makes them both but answering right back. Ryan Grunan knocks down the triple. That's a big shot. And the Lancers build on to their lead. It's 32-24, foul called here on Lawrence. It's an eight point lead for the home team here in the second quarter. Defensive foul called here against the Lancers. They're sixth of the half. Canary picks up his first personal foul. So the Lancer senior standout, not in foul trouble. That's only his first as BC High is gonna turn it over. Out of bounds, an unforced error there on the near sideline. Lancer basketball, here's Ocasio. Shifting across the paint, Ocasio to the right hand, looking to pass to the near side. Luciano can't get it to go, back rims it. Rebound, BC High. Now Dreheim pushing the pace up ahead to Savello. Dreheim all the way to Costello, can't get it to go. Toby looking for the rebound, grabs it, foul on BC High. Loose ball foul, it's gonna go against the Eagles. Lancers into the bonus now, so obviously that was not a shooting foul, but Toby's gonna get to the line for a one and one. Lancer is gonna try to extend their lead to double digits here with Toby at the stripe, makes the first, so he earns himself another one, 33-24 now. Lead is up to nine for the Lancers here against the Eagles. Again, as we've said all season, what a privilege it is to cover top team in the state Power rankings don't lie. The Lancers are number one. BC High not too shabby either though. They're in the top 25. Number 22 to be exact right now. And the Eagles are putting up a fight here against the Lancers. Costello from the corner. Way off. Foul is called though. So Costello is gonna get himself to the line. His shot was thrown off. Exactly five minutes to go here in quarter number two from LHS. First free throw rims out for Costello. Referee's talking things over here for a moment, perhaps about the number of free throws Costello might be getting here. As the players will retreat to their benches, looks like we're gonna have a timeout here in the second quarter. Five minutes to go in the first half. The score, Lancers 34 and the Eagles 24. Lancers will play their next game Tuesday, the 31st of January. That's going to be at Chelmsford. And our next broadcast, folks, you can look forward to 
Friday night, February the 3rd, the Lancers face off against North Andover, a top 10 team. And that's going to be a banger, folks. That's going to be a wonderful MVC contest right here in the Fieldhouse. I feel like I've heard myself say it a lot this season, but two of the best teams in the state, the Lancers have played a tough schedule all year, they put up a good fight against Worcester North despite the three-point loss, but besides that, it's been all W's for the Lancers. Here's Ocasio driving baseline. Now looking to pass. Bounce pass to Canary. Here's Marius. Marius the right-hand dribble. Now he picks it up inside to Toby. Give and go play. Canary to the basket. That was beautiful. That was amazing. If you are a basketball fan, it doesn't get much better than that. A classic little give and go between Canary and Toby playing the two-man game just to absolute perfection right there. The Lancers with some offensive rhythm here against BC High. The Eagles are going to have to step it up defensively if they want to hang with the Lancers here. Meanwhile, Eagles turn it over, so the Lancers have another possession as well as an 11 point lead. Ocasio with the jump pass. Ocasio gets it back, launches. Comes up short, Canary the offensive board. Here's Marius. Ocasio now, bounce pass to Toby. Ocasio gets it back to the near side, Marius. Left hand, hanging in the air. Marius back rims it though. Three minutes, 36 seconds to go here in the first half. Eagles basketball. 11-point game. The Lancers on top. Eagles can't save it, though. That's a backcourt violation. Lancer basketball with a chance to extend the lead. Canary running the point. Passes off to the far side, Ocasio has it. Castillo in front of the Eagle bench, gives it back to Ocasio. Now Canary fakes to his right, back to Ocasio, long three, comes up short. Toby fighting for the board, can't get it. Oh, and it was Canary trying for the right hand jam. Came up a little short though. That's going to be a travel on BC. Lancers, 11 point lead and possession here late in the second. Castillo's going to come out. Reyes going to come in. Canary's going to bring it up. Looking for Toby, back to Canary. Canary to the near side corner, Reyes. Back out and that's great defense by BC High and all the way to the bucket, Matt Dreheim in transition, turning defense into offense. And BC High cuts the lead down to single digits. It's a nine point game. Canary to the corner, nobody home. Lancers turn it over on two consecutive possessions. And that's going to prompt Moose to call a timeout here with the score. Lancers 36 and the Eagles 27. So, folks, as we mentioned during the last timeout, our next broadcast will be right here in the Fieldhouse Friday, February the 3rd. The Lancers will host the Scarlet Knights of North Andover. And the Knights, nine and four this year, they've played a tough schedule as well. Despite the four losses, that tough schedule puts them in the top 10 in the state. Yes, indeed. Lawrence at number one, Central Catholic number two. I beg your pardon. Catholic Memorial number two, Central Catholic number three, 
Franklin number four, Needham High number five, Newton North number six, North High number seven, and then you've got the Scarlet Knights of North Andover at number eight, so it should be a fantastic matchup here when LPS Media gets the cameras out to film. These two MVC rivals getting after it. 7 p.m. Friday night, the 3rd of February. We'd love to see you here, and if not, don't worry, we've got you covered on LPS Media. Check us out on YouTube or local cable. Two minutes, 10 seconds now to play in the second quarter. BC High down by nine. Chance to cut the lead, but the Eagles turn it over. Good defense by Lawrence to force the turnover. And let's see if the Lancers can extend. It'll be Reyes to bring the ball up now. Canary and Toby both on the bench for the moment. Long three for Lawrence High. Ocasio comes up short. Brunon has the offensive board. And now Reyes back in control. Less than two minutes to play in the first half. Three ball from the near side is good from Danny Reyes. A little instant offense. Danny Reyes knocking down the tray. In transition, Yambi can't answer. And the Lancers have another possession here. They're up 12. Moments before halftime here. Buck 13 to play. Lancers turn it over on this possession. BC High with a chance to cut into the lead. Just over a minute to play before halftime. Ocasio is guarding Yombi. Dreheim pulls up. Man, he can shoot the J. Matt Dreheim again hangs in the air. From the free throw line area, now Grunon, 4-3, back rims it. Nice rebound there by Reyes. Here's Danny, now Ocasio, over to the near side. Grunon with the pass inside to Igor, no good. Here's the three from the near side, and that's James Jones. His first shot of the game is a three, and he nets it. 39-32. Eight seconds to play in the quarter. Lancer's looking for the last shot. Here's Reyes with three seconds. Reyes with two seconds to the near side. Ocasio at the buzzer! He knocks down the three as the clock hits zero. What a way for the Lancers to head into the halftime break on the buzzer beating three by Ocasio. Folks, we wanna thank you so much for joining us here on LPS Media. The halftime score, 42 for the Lancers, 32 for BC High. We're gonna take Three of these kids belong together. Three of these kids are kind of the same. But one of these kids is doing his own thing. Or which of these kids is doing his own thing? Come on, can you tell which one? Can you guess which kid is doing his own thing? Guess before my song is done. And now my song is done. FRM News reminds you that during the cold weather season to bundle up by wearing coats, hats, and gloves. If you don't have these items, reach out to parents, teachers, or counselors. Enjoy your cold day in the sun. Stay toasty, everyone. It's your cold day in the sun. It's your cold day.
is right in front of you. Please put your phone down and join in. Just about set to get this third quarter underway. The Lancers and the BC High Eagles. BC High starting with the ball. The Lancers get a turnover. Marius Canary with the two-hand jam to start off the third quarter. A thunderous dunk to get this quarter underway. Man, I hope this crowd got back in their seats. After that halftime break, Canary gets the steal and takes it to the rack. And goodness, a timeout called by BC High. Just eight seconds into the third quarter. And hey, welcome back, Lancer fans. Here we go, third quarter action. Canary gets the steal, gets the dunk. It's 44-32 now. As the Eagles need to talk things over right away here in the third quarter. Marius Canary takes the bad pass and makes the Eagles pay. And the Eagles are all set to go here. On the court now, ready to resume this third quarter. Action-packed first half. The Lancers with a 10-point halftime lead. Now they extend it out to 12. It'll be Eagles basketball here. Eight seconds in to the third quarter. Here's the inbound. Now we're going to have a foul called before the inbounds pass. That foul is going to go on Reyes of the Lancers. He picks up his second personal. Of course, that's the first of this second half. And it's Eagles basketball here. Dreheim can't get that jumper to go on the baseline. And here come the Lancers in transition. This is Canary with a little Euro step to the bucket. Off the glass, no good. The bank not open yet. It is a Sunday after all. But Canary does draw the foul, so he's going to get to the stripe here with 7.31 to play in the third. You're going to have a technical foul called here, and Canary will be at the line shooting tees now as the Eagles get teed up. So technical foul and personal foul on this play. Canary makes the first free throw. Second one is good as well. And now that the technical free throws are over, Canary will shoot the personal foul shots. That's three of three so far. And Canary makes all four, making the Eagles pay from the free throw line. And I believe the Lancers will still have possession due to the technical foul. And Dreheim pleading his case to the referee. It is, in fact, going to be Lancer ball. They retain possession due to the tech. 7.31 to play here in the third quarter. It's been all Lancers here in the third quarter. A Canary dunk and four free throws. Now Toby with a little floater, no good. Long pass up ahead for the Eagles. Layup is good. And BC High on the board here in the third quarter. Long bounce pass off the mark. 
deflected out of bounds. See who it was last touched by. It did hit an eagle last before rolling into the Lancer bench. So Lancer basketball here, 48-35 the score. 7.07 to play here in the third. Reyes pulls back out. Reyes takes the shot. Rims out. And it's going to be Eagles basketball. It's going to be a foul called on the loose ball against Lawrence. Toby picks up the loose ball foul, fighting for the board. Here's Drehan. Castillo guarding him well. Drehan to the left hand, puts it up. That left handed shot, just money. Drehan has a sweet touch on that mid range jumper. And the Eagles down by 12 here, but still in striking distance. Every time the Lancers get a little breathing room, the Eagles come back to at least keep it close. Answer ball here, up by 12. Reyes looking for Grunan, couldn't find him. Now it's Canary. Canary switching to the left hand. Canary passes into the corner. Grunan falls down, taking the shot. It rims out. It's a back rim. Loose ball foul coming up. Six oh four to play here in the third. Braylon Castillo, the six-foot guard, picks up his first personal of the game. A loose ball foul called on him, so BC High with the ball. Yambi gonna bring the ball up against Reyes. Here's Castillo guarding Dreheim. Stolen by Toby underneath, long passes blocked. Toby couldn't come up with it. And now the Eagles get a free possession here. Yambi with the pass to Dreheim. Good ball movement for BC High. Costello couldn't get it to go, but he gets his own board. Now Dreheim back to Yambi. 48-36, third quarter action here from Lawrence. The number one ranked Lancers against the number 22 ranked BC High Eagles. Ivan Yambi. Canary guarding him. Passes off to Costello. Dreheim. Castillo guarding. Dreheim takes it, makes it. Cold blooded from Dreheim. That left handed shot. He's been accurate tonight. 48 39. Canary can't answer back. Out of bounds. Eagles basketball here. Nine point game. 48 39 is our score. Lancer is leading here in the second half. Here's the jumper from the far side. That one's good from Dan Civello. And the Eagles are inching closer and closer into this game. Ocasio, the three, front rims it. Rebound loose, grabbed by Toby. Toby to the basket. Comes up empty. Eagles ball. 48-42 the score. Fired up ahead. Savello underneath, off the glass and in. And BC High with all the momentum right now. The first two minutes of the quarter, it was all Lancers. And just like that, the Eagles are within four. 4.03 to play here in the third quarter. It's the Lancers, 48. And the Eagles, 44. Folks, we'll take this opportunity to remind you to check out the Lawrence Public Schools website on any browser, on any device. Just head on over to lawrencepublicschools.org. Currently featured, LHS held a civics class that was visited by Superintendent Juan Rodriguez. Juan Rodriguez, of course, in attendance here. 
right across the way. I can see him watching the game over in the bleachers. Also, the LHS mock trial team is ready for its upcoming competitions. You can cheer them on. And we also want to say congratulations to Dylan Brown from the Frost School. He is the LPS Artist of the Week. You can check out Dylan's artwork and you can read about all of these events and so much more at the LPS homepage on any device. Just head on over to lawrencepublicschools.org. Ocasio trying to break the momentum. Oh, what a shot. Jonathan Ocasio, cold-blooded from the top of the key. Four-point game, now a seven-point game after the three by Jonathan. Civello can't get it to go. Toby gets the easy board. Here comes Ocasio up the near side. He's going for it again. No good on the second three. Loose ball foul coming up. Looks like it's going against the Lancers. Toby gets the foul, that's gonna be his second. Interesting, both on loose balls going for rebounds. That kid fights hard on the glass. 51-44 the score. The answer's up by seven. Dreheim hanging in the air, fighting through the paint, gets two. Ocasio swings it to Luciano. And Luciano gets it back. Ocasio looking to pass to the near side. That three is good and a foul. What a shot by Joendi Rosario. Knocks it down from downtown. Draws the foul. He's getting to the line with a chance for a four point play. So BC High cutting into the Lancer lead here in the third, but a couple of huge threes, one by Ocasio and one by Rosario. Help the Lancer stay ahead. Four point play for Joendi Rosario. What a moment for him as the Lancers back up by nine. We have a foul before that inbound. And we have foul against the Lancers. Ocasio picks up the foul. That's his second personal of the game. Now the Lancers cheering as the referee talking to Dreheim of BC High. BC High already called for one technical in this game so far. It resulted in a couple of free throws for Marius Canary. No further calls as BC High will now inbound after the Lancer foul. Eagles down by nine. Third quarter action here from Lawrence. Happy Sunday to you and your family. Thank you for joining us here. Thank you for spending your Sunday with us. Another foul on Ocasio, that's gonna be his third. Tough defense by the Lancers as Dreheim drives to the basket. Ocasio picks up the foul again, that's his fourth. And Dreheim is just attacking Jonathan Ocasio right now. Couldn't convert the bucket, but the lefty Dreheim at the line. This is the first though, as Ocasio comes out. Canary comes back in. Dreheim makes one of two from the line. 55-47 now. Marius to Reyes. Marius Canary gets it back. Luciano, bad pass, stolen. 
all the way to the bucket. Dreheim, oh, Ganeri had it blocked, but the momentum of the shot. Basket is good, despite Canary getting his palm on that block. But the momentum of the layup from Dreheim results in a bucket for BC High. Far side three, no good. Rebound, Gonzalez going for it, but it's knocked out of bounds by Lawrence. Eagles ball. Lancers pressing here, it's a travel. Oh, that's good defense by Lawrence. They were easing up on the press a little bit, just a little bit. They bring it back to full strength. BC High travels, it's Lancer ball, but the Lancers turn it right back over. Under two minutes to play here in the third. Lancers with a third quarter lead on BC High. Into the paint and fumbled away, Lancer basketball. Fifty six forty nine the score with one forty to play here in the third. Lancers leading the Eagles. Time running out here in the third. Here's Marius. Now Santana gives it back to Canary. Canary, tough angle shot, and he knocks it down from the near side. High degree of difficulty on that baseline jumper by Marius Canary and Dreheim travels with it. Lancers get it back here. And Reyes will bring the ball up for Lawrence High. 58-49, it's a nine point lead for the hometown Lancers. Santana kicks it out. Canary swings it around to Reyes. The jumper, back rim, no good. Lawrence High with the offensive rebound. That was Rosario on the shot earlier, beg your pardon on that mistake, and now BC High gets the defensive rebound. Over to the far side. Eagles down by nine. Time running out, less than a minute to go here in the third. 51 seconds to be exact, here's Yombi. Hands off to Dreheim, guarded by Toby inside. The layup is good from Jerron Josephs. His first bucket of the game. 58-51, 18 seconds to go here in the quarter. The Lancers looks like they're gonna hold for the last shot. Here's Canary. Seven seconds to go, Canary takes the jumper, back rims it, rebound loose, four seconds to go. Second chance, no good, out of bounds, still Half a second to go here in the third quarter. You can see above the backboard, 0 0.5 seconds to go. It's gonna have to be a really quick catch and shoot here for the Lancers. 58-51 the score. Lancers trying to add to their lead with half a second left in the third. Here's the inbound pass and it's stolen. We head to the fourth, ladies and gentlemen, with the score. Lancers, 58, and the Eagles. 51. Before we head to the fourth quarter, we have a very special announcement. Former Abbott Lawrence Academy graduate, Ray Mojica is a collegiate cheer national and world champion. That is right. Ray, also a former member of the LPS media crew. What an amazing accomplishment for the former ALA graduate, Ray Mojica and extra credit for Ray for battling through adversity, injuries, surgeries. Ray has done an unbelievable job recovering from some tough medical conditions to become, as we said, a collegiate cheer national and world champion. What an accomplishment. And Ray worked with him just a few years ago Ray, an excellent member of our LPS Media crew, a cameraman, 
during many of our LPS media broadcasts, basketball games, football games, volleyball games, right here in this very gym. Ray Mojica, this is your moment, my friend. It's been a pleasure and a privilege working with you, and thank you for bringing the glory and the pride back home to Lawrence. Fourth quarter underway with a jumper from Canary. It's no good. Toby the board. The putback is good from the big man. 60 to 51. Lawrence High extending the lead up to nine points here in the fourth. Foul called. Looks like it's going to be a defensive foul against the Lancers here on this BC High possession. Toby picks up his third. So once again, it was Toby picking up the foul. So at the line, this will be Dan Civello, the 6'9", junior forward. First free throw is good. 60-52 now after that free throw. Eight point game here, seven and a half minutes to go in the fourth. Canary ticking on two defenders, draws the foul. Two foul shots coming up for Marius. Seven twenty-seven to play here now. Fourth quarter action here from Lawrence. Canary at the line as the Lancers lead by eight. Let's see if he can extend it. First free throw as Canary gets the hometown roll. Sixty-one fifty-two. The score. Canary is not able to make it a 10 point game. So the Lancers on top by nine here. Nice jumper there from the corner. BC High needs to step up the offense here in the fourth and that's gonna help him out. Now Reyes looking for Ocasio here as the guards pass back and forth. Ocasio, Reyes. Thought about the long three, gets a little closer, takes it, back rims it, rebound loose. It's Grunon. Reyes thought about it again. Now Jonathan Ocasio looking inside. Nice little shot there by Grunon from point blank range. Made sure he didn't miss. Ryan Grunon with a pair for Lawrence High. The three ball from the corner in front of the Eagles bench is good. The Eagles hanging in there, 6.30 to play in the fourth. Lancers leading. Here's Canary, inside to Toby. Wide open is Reyes. What a great pass from Toby. 65-55 after the bucket. Excellent vision by the big man, Toby. And that's going to be a jump ball. Good defense there by Reyes. He thought he had it, but they call it jump ball. Reyes fighting it away from Yambi. Reyes just wanted it more. Thought he had a steal, but they call it jump ball. And so it'll be BC High's possession after the possession arrow. Nice inbounds pass to Savello, who gets an easy two. They definitely drew that one up in practice. And now Lancer basketball, whistle. Defensive foul on BC High on that possession. And so the Eagles keeping it close here, but Lawrence High, five point lead. Oh, 
very quick pace to the first three quarters of this game, but slowing down a little bit here as the defense is intensifying. The fouls are piling up here in the fourth. The Lancers have been leading the majority of this game. Small leads. Lancers have gotten it up to 12, but every time Lawrence High gets a little bit of breathing room, BC High makes a couple of shots and gets back into it. So here we go, here in the fourth. It's a five point game. Lancers on top. Castillo gets it into Canary. Reyes to the near side, Grunon for three, and he knocks it down. That's a big shot by Ryan Grunon to make it an eight point game. Now BC High in transition. Corner three is good. That's a huge bucket. The Eagles and the Lancers trading haymakers here in the fourth. What an atmosphere at Lawrence High. Every time Lawrence High has made a big shot, the Eagles have answered back as Reyes comes up empty on the long three. Castillo gets called for the foul, loose ball foul on him here in this five point game. 5.13 to play, fourth quarter action. Castillo, second personal for him. Foul shots on the way for BC High. First free throw is no good. Front half of the one and one. Eagles can't convert. Five point game. Just over five minutes to go. Canary slashing through the entire defense. Couldn't convert on the bucket. Has it deflected out of bounds. Remains Lancer ball. 5.02 left in the fourth. Into the corner. Reyes stops. Canary thought about the three. Now kicks it away. Canary turns it over. Yambi up the other way. Yambi can't make the layup. Out of bounds. Remains eagle ball. 4.49 left in the fourth. 68-63 is our score. Eagles trying to cut into the five point lead. Here's Yambi. Foul called. That basket doesn't count as Castillo is called for the foul well before the shot. Eagles in the bonus here, so foul shots coming up despite the lack of a shot on that play. Yambi gets the roll on the first free throw. 68-64. Four point game. Now, Yambi misses the second, so the Lancers have it with a four point lead here in the fourth quarter. Canary for three. That was on the money, but he came up short. In transition, rebound goes to Canary. Canary looking for the alley oop to Toby. That's a great pass by Toby to Reyes, who draws the foul. The alley-oop pass from Canary to Toby was just a bit off the mark, and Toby had the awareness to grab it and quickly pass to Reyes. Reyes goes straight to the rack and draws the foul, so not exactly beautiful offense, but hey, it gets the job done, and Reyes is at the line for a pair of free throws here with 4.16 to play in the fourth. First free throw good, it's a five point lead for the Lancers. Danny Reyes makes them both, those were very important free throws. Lancers controlling the game here so far. Costello back rims it. 
Rebound loose, Civello. Now Toby has it. Toby with the pass up the far side. The three from Lawrence is no good. Toby gets the board, puts it down. Toby the floater, no good. Rebound, BC high. And the whistle is gonna go against Lawrence here. Foul coming up. Loose ball foul on the home team. Eagles in the double bonus here, so no more one and ones. The Eagles will have two free throws no matter what. Back rim on the first free throw from James Jones. Sophomore guard, 6'3". 3.49 to go, Eagles down by six. They need all the offense they can get. And from the line, Jones makes one of two, so that makes it a five-point game. All right, here we go, folks. It's officially crunch time. Under four minutes to play in the game. Lancers have a five-point lead. Here we go, down the home stretch. Canary to the basket, gets his own rebound. Canary puts it up again, and he draws the foul. 3.31 to play here in the fourth. Marius at the line, shooting two. Very interesting pace to this game, as I said earlier. Three quarters of nonstop action. And it's like both coaches just told their teams to D up regardless of the fouls that are just piling up. The pace has slowed down. A lot of foul shots here in the fourth. Both teams in the bonus. A little bit different, especially from the first half. We're going up and down the court with long passes on either side. Fast breaks galore, but things tightening up here. I'm running out on the Eagles as Canary gets both free throws, 72-65. It's a seven point game. From the far side, Costello. Costello driving baseline, what a move, but he couldn't finish. What a great move by Costello. Rims out though. It's a seven point game, Lancers on top. All the way out to Ocasio, long three from Jonathan. No good, out of bounds. Lancers retain possession. And we're gonna have a timeout here in the fourth quarter with the score Lancers 72 and the Eagles 65. Down the home stretch we go here in the fourth. We'll take this opportunity to remind you to once again check out the Lawrence Public Schools YouTube channel. Hey, some facts about our channel. In addition to our YouTube channel, we do broadcast on local cable, Comcast Channel 99 and Verizon Channel 41. Check us out. Yeah, we're an urban school district in Lawrence, Massachusetts, serving more than 13,000 students in 38 wonderful public schools. Since joining YouTube in 2012, yes, that was... 11 years ago, our channel has amassed over 1.8 million views on over 1,000 videos. So we want to thank you for being a part of our success. Thank you for watching LPS Media. It is a pleasure and a privilege to serve the city of Lawrence. Two fifty-nine to go in the game. The Lancers only one loss this season. Number one ranked team in the state. BCI Eagles, a perennial powerhouse, number twenty-two in the state. They are no joke coming in here to Lawrence, fully intending on knocking off the number one ranked Lancers. Time running out though on the Eagles. They're down by only seven though. Lancers have possession. BC High needs a turnover. They need a stop and they need points. The Lancers happy to take their time here as Reyes has possession. Now Ocasio into Marius Canary to the basket and that is a huge bucket for Lawrence High. Marius Canary just waltzing into the paint Hits the floater, 
And that could be curtains. It's a nine point game. BC High still has shooters. They still have offense. Anyone's game, but man, that felt like a dagger from Marius. Lancer's feeling confident on offense here. 74 points on the night. Here's the pass back to Yambi. Stolen by Lawrence High. Second chance, no good. The foul is called. Great defense in these final crunch time moments for the Lancers. Foul called on Ivan Yombi, the captain. It's only his second. The Lancers now lead by nine, though. Rosario can't make the first. He has a chance, though, now to make it a 10 point game. Rosario misses them both. Out of bounds over the baseline, the Lancers retain possession. So 2-11 to play in the game, it's still Lancer ball. Despite the missed free throws, they still have a chance to extend the lead. Here's Canary in traffic, gives it to Toby. Missed the dunk, but Canary still has it. Ocasio for three, front rims it. Two minutes to go in the game. Nice tip there by Ocasio, but it goes straight to the Eagle. Shots no good. Toby gets the board out of bounds here near side. Remains Lancer ball. Ocasio's gonna come out. Grunan is gonna come back in. Still a nine point game. Whistles here as the, there's a mistake on the clock, it appears, behind the backboard. Getting the clocks all situated here. Final moments of this ball game between BC High and Lawrence High. Lawrence High trying to improve to 15 and one. BC High under 500, they're five and nine, playing a really tough schedule though. Ranked 22 in the state. Can the Lancers hang on here? They've got a nine point lead. Time running out here in the fourth. Reyes happy to take his time. And the Eagles are not really forcing the issue here. Another whistle. Once again, the referee has to go over to the scorer's table to check the clock. Head coach Moose Moore over on the far sideline shouting out instructions to these young men who've had a phenomenal season so far, one of the best seasons in the history of this high school. Far from over though. Seven games left in the regular season. And then the Lancers will hope to make a playoff run. Here's Canary, pulls up, jumper is good. And that's the dagger, folks. Drive home safely. Marius Canary said you can all go home. What a shot. Jumper, nothing but net. As BC High is able to answer back quickly in the paint, but the Lancers with a great performance down the stretch, hitting some foul shots, hitting some big threes. Marius Canary with a pair of daggers here in the fourth. And this one's all but a formality now. Moose wants to call timeout here to talk things over with the score 76 to 67 here in the final moments of the fourth quarter. Once again, the Lancers, 14 and one, trying to get their 15th win on the year, just moments away from doing so. Our next broadcast, my friends, Friday night, February the 3rd, right here in the Fieldhouse. 
The LHS boys basketball team takes on the Scarlet Knights of North Andover, an MVC battle between the state's top team and the state's eighth ranked team. It's going to be a banger, folks. You have to be here. Witness history, witness one of the best teams that this school has ever produced. You're not gonna wanna miss Friday night's game. It'll be a great way to start off the weekend. And hey, if you can't make it, no worries. We've got you covered on LPS Media. We will be on YouTube, Comcast Channel 99, Verizon Channel 41. 37.8 seconds to go here in the ball game. It's been real here. This Sunday at Lawrence High. We're working on weekends. We're getting W's on the weekends here. As Toby puts it up and comes up short, BC High gets the rebound. An exciting game between the Eagles and the Lancers. 17 seconds to go as a timeout is called. Take a look at the schedule for the remainder of the season. Again, the Lancers will play at Chelmsford Tuesday the 31st. Hoping to get a win against the Lions. And then as we mentioned a moment ago, the Lancers host North Andover. On Tuesday, February the 7th, the Lancers host Lowell. Home game on Friday, February 10th against Drakeit. And then we hope your significant other is into basketball because on Valentine's Day, game of the season perhaps, we mentioned earlier the Lancers played Central Catholic on the road and got a big win. The Lancers played Central Catholic in the Commonwealth Motors Christmas Tournament and got a win. So the Lancers are 2-0 against their arch rivals from Central this season. The third and final regular season matchup between the teams will be on Valentine's Day, yes. Love me some basketball on Valentine's Day. Tuesday night, February 14th, and then the Lancers host Andover on Friday the 17th, and then the season will end on the road at Brookline, Monday, February 20th, as the jumper is no good. Toby gets the board. Three seconds on the clock, two seconds on the clock. The Lancers, the top team in the state of Massachusetts, get a win over BC High. BC High goes to five and 10, while the Lancers improve to 15 and one. Folks, we wanna thank our entire crew for making today's broadcast possible. Steven, Eli, our producer, Mr. Luis Lopez. My name is Jay Oza, and now, Let's pass it down to our wonderful producer, Miss Suzanne Fernandez, with some post-game coverage. We are here with Lancer senior Marys Canary after a tremendous win, Lancers over BC High. How are you feeling? I'm good. Feels good to win. I mean, could have played better, but a win's a win. Yeah, they played played us tough. Tough team. That was a good challenge for you guys. You've had an excellent season, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was, a, it was a good challenge. They played us hard. We know every, every team's going to give up, give us their best game, so we got to better prepare for that in the future. You've played different teams this year than, you, than you're used to. How has that been for your – you've got a, a win streak going, but how's that been? Um, it's good to just play um, teams from around the area, like outside of NBC and stuff. So, yeah, it's good to see these different teams. Excellent. Well, we'll let you get back to your team. Thank you so much for – an excellent game. We had a lot of fun watching. <laughs>